County department leaders presented budget plans for 2024 to the Shawnee County Commission on Monday. We uh, pr put our budget together, make a proposal. Um, it's based on different costs as far as salaries for our staff, also breaks down into contractual items and uh, office, office items is ba are basically the three top areas that we break it down into. Shawnee County Health Department Director Teresa Fisher says staffing shortages continue to raise concerns in the public health field. Staffing is definitely an ongoing issue with us. Uh, we currently have um, 13 different vacant positions within the health department, although not all are advertised. Um, our main uh, need continues to be uh, registered nurses. Another challenge? Fisher says the assistance her department received during the pandemic is no longer available. Grant funding has been our biggest change, um, and this is our first year actually being a part of the general fund. And so coupled with that and grant changes, um, it was a different budget process for us this year. County Commissioner Bill Rippon says the rising cost across the board is reflected in many budget proposals. We've seen a little bit more of a request for a little more money, uh, most of the departments, and most of that's due to insurance and wages going up. Rippon says difficult choices are inevitable when attempting to allocate the county's resources. Sometimes you have to make some difficult cut, cuts, you know, and uh, you just uh, look at your priorities and, and what you think the needs are uh, over wants, and, uh, and you you make your decisions. One decision the board has yet to make is whether or not to increase the mill levy for 2024. I don't know if it's going to increase or decrease at this point. Uh, we'll know more when we, we get into finalizing the budget and then we'll set our mill levy accordingly.